Cisco SD-WAN offers a software-defined WAN solution that enables enterprises and organizations to connect users to their applications securely. It's an architecture that is highly secure, open, programmable, scalable, and is multi-cloud ready. Service providers can use Cisco SD-WAN to interconnect to applications and workloads residing in their on-premises data centers, private cloud, or public cloud, such as AWS, Azure, and Google Cloud, using flexible transports, such as internet, MPLS, 4G, and 5G. Cisco SD-WAN multi-tenancy enables managed service providers, or MSPs, to manage multiple customers, called tenants, through the same SD-WAN network management system, vManage, using the same set of server resources. This differs from a single tenancy model for deploying SD-WAN controllers, in which server resources such as CPU, memory, and storage need to be allocated for every customer that the MSP manages. The MSP has to log in to each individual customer's GUI interface to configure the network and control policies to enable each customer network. But now, with Cisco SD-WAN multi-tenancy, MSPs no longer need to reserve dedicated controllers for every tenant, but instead can leverage the same set of controllers that are deployed to manage and onboard tenants. The MSP gets control, visualization, and access to the individual configurations of each tenant using provider privileges. And each tenant that the provider creates also has a dedicated tenant portal and can be assigned tenant admin privileges to build network configurations and policies specific to their organization's requirements. For example, customer A may wish to provide internet access to corporate users directly from the branch versus customer B, who wants to divert all branch traffic through the MSP's data center before connecting to the internet. MSPs benefit from both CapEx and OpEx savings by leveraging Cisco SD-WAN multi-tenancy. You can save on capital expenses by reducing servers, rack space, and cables for controllers, and gain operational savings with simplified and optimized network operations via a common dashboard across tenants. MSPs can start small with a three-node vManage cluster and expand to a six-node cluster as needed to accommodate a multitude of tenants and thousands of devices on the same SD-WAN network management system. MSPs can also choose to deploy controllers in their own data centers or request Cisco to deploy and manage the controller infrastructure in Cisco Cloud. To summarize, Cisco SD-WAN multi-tenancy benefits MSPs by providing a single dashboard for managing a multitude of customers, that is, tenants, who enjoy robust security and segmentation between each other, distinct provider and tenant level roles, each with their own unique management portal, analytics and health information for each branch, transport, and device through a single vManage GUI, easy and automatic onboarding for thousands of devices using zero-touch provisioning, cloud on-ramp technology that automates secure, optimized connectivity to the cloud, which can be further configured to suit individual tenants' needs, and unified communication services for custom call processing policies unique to each endpoint and branch level. Learn more about Cisco SD-WAN multi-tenancy at cisco.com slash go slash SD-WAN dash MT. Go here to learn more about Cisco SD-WAN multi-tenancy.